All right, guys, welcome back to another video. Thank you for being here. Listen, a couple of months ago, we came across a game called Choo Choo Charles. Something with the premise of being an open world survival horror game. We're talking about literally the most viewed video, reaction video on, on my channel. And here's the thing, back then when the game was announced, it was only with a trailer. The developer of this game, Two Star Games, just a couple hours ago came out with pre-alpha footage. So we're gonna see what it is. I have a feeling it's gonna be an interesting one. So without further ado, let's see what it is. Now, if I'm not mistaken, this is actually an entire video about programming this whole game. But then earlier in the video, uh, Two Star Games, the guy in charge of developing the game, suggests that there's going to be more gameplay of it, which is this. I mean, the graphics still the same. These things were not here before. What were those? So... This is this was actually a question to me. He intentionally does that to bring Charles out or something. He does it intentionally. Yeah. So now he has a health bar. He's got different weapons to deal with this thing. Damn, that's a that's a big health bar. Would I be going too far if I call this a Souls-like game, but... <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, so it has something like an active system to, like, repair the train itself. I wonder if he's actually outside of the train. What's gonna happen to him then? Like, is he gonna get damaged? Like, is he gonna die instantly? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Alright, there's this. Wait, there was a lot of more. Wait a minute, I gotta see this again. Also, once it reaches half HP, in order to keep itself alive, it just goes away. Dude, that's a huge world. Look at that shit, scary. What the hell, man? Look at this sky. <laughs> wow. Be sure to wishlist Choo Choo yeah. Charles on Steam, subscribe to the channel, and also don't forget to check out Core. Link in the description. Now, this has been such a mystery to me personally that how could somebody make an entire game, especially if it's some kind of a really good looking game, alone? How? Just how can a single developer, like one person, create an entire game with a graphic like that? Like I'm talking about something like Bright Memory Infinite, you all know that game. So here's the deal guys, I'm gonna leave a link to this particular video on the developer's page. Actually, it's it's a YouTube channel called Two Star Games, it's a, it's a guy that's been making this game. And you can have a really good idea of what stage this game's development is right now. Because I've come to notice that this guy is actually having a really tough time developing this game but he's making it somehow. But there's nothing to worry about though, this game is being developed slowly but steadily. It is probably not gonna come out early next year, I'm guessing late 2022, but as you've come to notice it ain't no Joe, I mean we're talking about an open world game. However, to be really fair, from what I've learned, this game's actually going really smooth so far. I don't know how this guy is pulling this, but he's doing a great job so far. He's instantly coming up with more updates on his YouTube channel. He's coming up with more improvements daily, taking ideas. So go ahead and make sure to visit the channel. He's actually asking for some good ideas. If you have any, go ahead. But that's it. Thank you for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you guys again in the next one. Take care, everybody. Peace.